hey, we parked right next to it again. It's actually really nice. There's a building right there, too, with a roof. With a roof. Good. If we park near a building, I would prefer it being one with a roof on it, because then we can use it as a sniping position. And also because we're close enough to it that anybody on the roof can't really see us getting off our ship. So this is super convenient. This is exactly how I'd prefer to have it. We can get Dimitri to back up a bit. We take our time walking around in case we spot something. Whoa, just get a couple people off the ship first in case something like that happens. Fucking orchards. I swear, an alien always spawns in the middle of them. Always. Never fails. Really? What is it, a muton or something and it's blending in? There's definitely one back there. Yeah, it's a muton blending in. Bastards. Can we hit him? Oh, misclick. Got him in the leg. Hmm. You know, for being as accurate as you are, I would expect these auto shots to be a little better. Just kneel, get that extra 5% in for the auto fire. Yeah, wow, jeez, okay. Well, Barbara just stepped to the side. You're hiding behind a tree, technically, so. We'll see. We'll take some shots out from the uh, Sky Ranger and. Ooh. See, how many trees are actually in the way here? Just the one? I think just the one tree was in the way, so we should be okay now. Yeah, headshot! Nicely done, Lamidia. I'm saying Lamidia because I don't know what the hell that you's doing there. Mm -hmm. End the turn, everybody's in a bad spot. Somebody got shot at from an angle that I don't see, probably from behind us somewhere. Or that fence is broken. Oh. That's awkward. I wonder if there's a guy back there. Oh. Oh. There he is. Well, shit. Alright. You know what? If I throw a proximity there... Should be okay. Because the door will be open. Fuck. Please don't die. Ah, I was gonna say the door should be open. Which should stop the blast from hitting Nahiro. However, Nahiro is in cover. And... Well, is in cover from the door opening. So he still shouldn't die. Concerned about Igor's life. Uh... I really doubt you can throw it up and over the Sky Ranger and make that happen. Boy, I don't know, but you're in position. We'll try it. Grenade's activated. Throw it on that side. Oh my god, Barbara Kemp. Perfect throw, now hero. I'm assuming what'll happen is Mutant will step out, the door will open, the grenade will explode, blowing the door off its hinges, now hero should be okay. I don't know. The Mutant's not gonna die from the explosion anyway, I don't think, so I don't I don't even know. We'll just end the turn because I'm kind of afraid to get anybody else off. Oh, shot from up there. Oh. That turn did not go as planned. Of course, the door being blown off its hinges stopped him from being in cover, but the Mutant stepped out far enough that it didn't really matter. Oop, oop, oop. You saw him from there. He should be weakened. Very good, Barbara. Alright, now we got shot from up there as well, the back side of the ship. Had to get Lamidia off. <sighs> Gotta get Gidron off next turn. You know what? Let's just end it. We'll just try from a different angle. We'll we'll go through the building.
Are you hurt? Oh, God, you're wounded. I didn't realize you got shot. Well, you have 28 turns, so... Should be okay. Hang on on the side of the wheel while we should be alright. Boy, just how bad these little missions can go. I don't have that many soldiers because it's just a small, but it does mutons. Now how did that happen? I just heard one die. Spontaneous co combustion? You, and there's another one over there, I think. Alright, let's make this happen. God, I... Are you really the guy who's been shooting me? You're really far away. Like, really far away. Just take a snapshot. I want to guarantee you have enough time to... Ah, yeah, there's, there's the other one. Guarantee you have enough time to get out of there. Alright. Well then. Uh, didn't want that. Oh god, don't shoot me through the window. I know you wanna. We'll try it. No, yeah, okay. It was a stupid ramp, man. What about from there? I think maybe the angle from earlier worked because it was an angle, so I was kind of shooting down the ramp. There we go. Oh, right in the deck. Oh, twice. Well done. Dimitri, knowing where it hurts. Please don't die. Uh, Gudrun should be okay. You should be alright. I'm assuming that Mutan's gonna walk up to you and try to kill you, or he'll just be a dick and kill Barbara through a window. He'll just be a dick and kill Barbara through a window. See, I've played Superhuman before. I know what you're like, game. Uh, I didn't want to move her there. I wanted to move her here. Mmm, misclick. And you're getting around the corner and get shot. No? Wow. You'll shoot at him and miss and get shot? Oh. Ooh, got him. Alright, wasn't expecting that to actually work. Alright, Dimitri, get back on the ship. You're the only one who's actually keeping us together right now. We have a whopping two soldiers left to clear the craft. We have high explosives. I might need to do a little bit of martyrdom here. And prime it and keep it on my belt. And just run into the ship. Because if there's a couple mutants in there, I don't have the firepower to take them down. We'll open it up and see, though. It's actually... Ugh, so awkward. Don't just stand there, throw me a spear. Make sure I'm actually choosing throw. There we go. There we go, good luck guys. Peace. You know, just in case there's one in the doorway. Well, open fire. Hope for the best. Got one of them. 
You need to not be there. God, I really don't think I can throw it that far. We'll try it. Next turn. Oh, 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 he doesn't know what he's doing. He's confused. Gudrun can pull it off. Oh, so close. So unfortunate. I'm upset that it's actually come down to this. Why do you do that? Boom! Obliterated those corpses. Dimitri's brain is really squishy as far as Sonic's go, so I don't mind much if he dies. I'm just a little upset that this will be... Oh, there's another over there? Oh god, Dimitri, it's not just 1v1. Oh shit. Your reactions are decent. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Action! What a ghost. I would fly to the top of the ship, but I said no flying! Ow, I got shot in the head! Thank god for flying armor. Uh, I'm not even injured. I'm not even hurt. And that's why he's captain or commander or whatever it is. God, that went horribly. Ugh. Ugh, uh, I need dudes. I need lots of dudes. I have 10.6 million dollars. Wow, I can have a lot of dudes. Oh, because I sent engineers over. That's right. I don't know, 20. Mm, who cares? We have tons of money. Mm. May as well do something while you're doing nothing. Just build workshop and living quarters. It'll be a really awful, small, crappy place to work and live. But you you live there and you make med kits every day. That's all you do. That's the rest of your life now. Welcome to XCOM technician guy. Or engineer, whatever you're called. Ugh. Can't believe I just saved that. Ugh. Okay, research completed. We know what alien retaliation is. There we go, Hyperwave Decoder. That's why I really did it. Now, there's a bunch of things that I gotta do here. I think for the sake of time, and for the sake of knowing exactly what I need to do, I'll do the Sectoid Leader. Because if this alone doesn't give me what I need it to give me, that being the MC Lab, then I need to do that Sectoid base in Africa. And I'll need to bring along a bunch of stun bombs and stuff, and just clean house. And I would like to bring heavy plasma for the um, for the cyber discs because they're really resilient to well everything else. I think they're really resilient to laser and just normal damage from everything else, but they're still really healthy and reactive. So I want to kill them when I see them as soon as I can. And I can't really do anything ah until the dudes show up. Mmm, lots of dudes. And workshop's done, and research is completed! Yay, Psylab! So I don't have to do that Sectoid base. Which is fantastic news. We will go straight into the Psylab. And then the Hyperwave Decoder. And... Grav Shield. I think Grav Shield is a base defense thing. It slows down... Um... Alien craft when they're attacking your base just long enough so your plasma or not plasma defenses I should get those eventually, but so your base defenses can actually reload and fire a second shot at them Which is pretty nice. However due to I think a bug in the game if you shoot down an alien sub it, it They'll just send another one and they'll keep doing that until 
they land and you take them down in honest tactical combat. God, we scouted him from far away. All right, we can go from, uh, I, I guess we can go from, from Alps, Let's see if we can catch him. God, he's going fast. Wow, he's going really fast. Where's he heading? Out here somewhere. Head north more. There he is. Wow, he swung back. Are you the very small? No, low, very, um, very low, small. Low on fuel. Okay, five seconds. Um, from scout that base down, down in Africa. Go get him from way up there. God, he's going back. What is he doing? He must just be scouting or something. I think they really want to have a base up in Siberia, and he's just really tracking lost. Would he go to space? All right. Well, we lost him somehow up by Siberia. Something's going on up here. There's so much activity. End of the month is here, waiting for that terror mission. Or was it a mid-month terror? No, that was last month, I think. Small, very low heading east. We should be able to get you. You're right there. Yeah. Um, yeah, we'll shoot you down over water. That's fine. Boom. And can't do the mission because he's over water, but that's fine. Um, would like to get some armor and stuff before I head off and do what could be really awful smalls. Very large, very low. That would be a terror mission. God, I think. That's not a terror mission. Oh my god, it hurts. That's not a terror mission. That's not a terror mission at all.